Good day. If you've got a string of uh, text and letters and you want to separate them, it can be quite a challenge. Um, so what we're going to do is provide a formula that will let you do that. So you can see in the example here on the left column, I've got um, a bunch of numbers and then a bunch of letters and then a bunch of numbers and a bunch of letters and uh, cleverly again, a bunch of numbers and a bunch of letters, but there are different points. In the, um, in the string. So you can't use the typical right and left uh, commands uh, to pull out the, uh, to separate the numbers and letters. So uh, what we've got here are three formulas that I've jammed into one and I'm going to go over those right now. So the first formula is this insanely long one. Um, I wouldn't bother to, uh, to read it or worry about it, just copy it from the, uh, from the blog um, on urtech.ca, but um, if you take a look at it, really what it's doing is it's saying, look, if it isn't a number, if there's, evaluate this thing and see if there's a, see if there's a number in here, a letter, uh, sorry, a number in here. And if there isn't, that means it's a letter. And if it's a letter, that means that's where we want to start. So he's looking for is error. Now, um, that's a formula I just flat out stole from uh, this guy, uh, Alan Wyatt, uh, who is now my hero. So, um, Here's the formula. Uh, he's uh, he's on tips.net. Um, here's the formula here that we stole, and um, you'll see, well expanded. I shouldn't say stole. That's that's not fair. But anyway, there it is. Now uh, beyond that, of course, uh, what we want to do is figure out the, um, the. Now here's your traditional stuff. We want to take the left set of characters uh, from cell A1, and we want it to. Um, uh, only take the the, the, the characters uh, up to the first letter and then minus one because we don't want to include the first letter. And you can see here, there it is. It, uh, it, uh, it's left, A1, comma, D1, minus one, and uh, that translates to the 21213. And then the same thing on right over here for the, uh, for the letters. So right, A1, land, blah, blah, blah. This is pretty standard stuff if you know what you're doing with Excel. Now, uh, there are a couple of quirks here. So what I've done is I've put, the, I've put the formulas together. So here, I've said, okay, take the left um, of, uh, of this uh, up until you hit a number, or sorry, up until you hit a letter, and then uh, stop. And you can see that's exactly what it's done. So if I go into here and I change this to, um, you know, it'll change automatically. And if I add, um, if I add a, a, a Q in here, we'll say, it'll change to that. So you get the idea. Okay, so I'm going to just strip that back just for fun. So there's the formula for the letters, uh, for the, the to strip off the uh, first letter uh, numbers, and there is the formula to strip off the uh, first um, uh, letters. And I'll put these formulas in the blog so you don't have to go look for them. Okay, so there's one very important thing to know about this. See these uh, French brackets, which uh, many people call uh, curly brackets? Uh, that means that it's an array. Um, so what that means is when you paste this in, so let's take this formula right here, and uh, I'm just going to copy it. Actually, let's delete this so it's gone, then I'll put it back. So if I go into here and I just paste that in, it's not going to work. Uh, and you'll notice the difference between these two cells is one has French brackets and the other doesn't, right? So the way to make this an array is to paste it in and use the control plus the shift and then press the enter key on your keyboard. So you paste it into this uh, into the uh, formula bar and then you press control, shift, enter and that will add the French brackets. If you add them manually it will not work. You need to make it an array and the only way to make it an array is control, shift, enter. So that's what we've done. Uh, that's it. If you have any uh, questions or concerns please get a hold of us at urtech.ca and uh, we'll go from there. Thank you. Bye-bye.